Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a lovely day today. So for today's video, I thought I would tell you guys what my current like favorite makeup products are. And I don't have something for every single category because these are genuinely my favorite makeup products that like I absolutely love. And I didn't wanna just put stuff in categories if I didn't actually really, really like the products. So these are makeup products that I genuinely love, adore can't live without <laughs> um so yeah with all that being said you guys know the drill by now i'm really trying to hit 700 subscribers before my birthday so if you are new around here please consider subscribing because yeah i want to hit 700 subscribers before my birthday and if you're not new around here and you want to help leave a like because that really really does help me out and leave a comment as well if you don't know what to comment just comment algorithm and with all that being said let's get into the video so I'm gonna jump straight into it. The primer that I've absolutely been loving and I'm so glad I decided to roll into my project pan is the e.l.f. putty primer. Now I loved this when I first got it and then I used it for a bit, but then I started project panning and I'd kind of forgot about it. I'd not really used it. And yeah, I've been using it to death and I absolutely love it. I love how it makes my skin look. I love how it I feel like it genuinely helps keep my makeup on longer and it gives like that flawless base. I really, really, really like it and I am going to be a bit gutted when it's gone and once I've emptied some of my other primers, I will 100% be repurchasing this. Okay, so then foundation. So this is going to be a little bit boring, but again, it comes from my project pan and I'm so glad that I rolled this in. I absolutely love the EX1 Invisiwear Liquid Foundation it wears so well on my skin even when my oils start to come through they don't like break the foundation up in a horrible way like it just looks like i've got a bit of a more oily complexion but the rest of my base still looks the same as when i first applied it just now in more of an oily state and i have worn this foundation one day i literally wore it for like 12 13 hours and it looked still really really good by the end of the day and i hadn't touched up all day i'd like blotted my face a little bit but i'd not touched up with powder and it just lasted so well so i love this foundation i'm in no rush to get it out so i'm hoping it's going to be in my project pan for a while because i've got so many foundations that i need to use before i even consider buying a new one so i'm gonna be gutted when this one is gone Sorry, I'm growing my fringe out and now it's at like a awkward length where I really don't like how it looks. <laughs> anyway, so next up, concealer. Now this is a bit of a newer find for me, but you'll see when I show you the close up that I've used it enough to know that I love it. So that is the NYX Bear With Me Concealer Serum. I love this stuff. Wears under my eyes really, really well has really good coverage but doesn't look cakey it powders really well i absolutely love this concealer and honestly i've seen people use this as like a foundation all over their face and i'm tempted to try it but i've already used like a good third or maybe even more of this product and i absolutely love it and it's definitely going to be one that i repurchase because it's just it's life-changing it's the first concealer that i've used that i've absolutely loved that's not too dry or horrible under my eyes and it powders down well and it lasts really well under my eyes so then setting powder and i got this for christmas i repurchased it for christmas with the christmas money that i got and that is the laura mercier translucent setting powder now i had this years ago and i absolutely loved it and then brought a load of powders and just never really brought it back but i've been struggling with my under eye area like you guys know and yeah i just really wanted to find a few new powders that really really work for me and this powder lasts me so long so i brought this powder so that i have one to fall back on and i can still test out a few new powders but i absolutely love this this is like a fail safe for me like it cannot go wrong i love this powder it just makes everything looks so good and it wears really well under my eyes and it sets the rest of my face down really well i just love this powder with all of my heart and then setting sprays i need to repurchase this setting spray as soon as possible i'm gonna get it before i go on holiday because i think it's the setting spray that i'm gonna take on holiday with me and that is the milk makeup 
Hydro Grip Setting Spray. This setting spray is amazing because it really does make my makeup last longer, but it's not like dry or matte. It's quite hydrating. So it's like the best of both worlds. It keeps my makeup on longer, but it hydrates my skin really well and gets rid of all of that like powdery look because I do use quite a lot of powder um, because I want my makeup to last longer and powder products just seem to wear a bit better on my oily skin. Um, but yeah, I love this setting spray and definitely one I'm gonna repurchase. And I've literally got about a third of this left, which, it's a bit scary for me. I don't want it to run out. <laughs> okay, then for brows, I don't have like a current favourite brow pencil or brow pen or powder or anything, but I do have a favourite brow gel and that is the NYX The Glue, The Brow Glue. And I brought this because I'd heard of a lot of people saying it's like quite good and I was like, do you know what? I'm gonna just try it because a lot of the brow gels I have at the minute I really don't like. And I've used this so much that it's almost all gone. And I brought it just before Christmas. So yeah, I really, really like this. And it holds my eyebrows in place really, really well. It helps me shape them really, really well as well. I just really, really like it. And I will continue to repurchase it. This is a really, really good eyebrow glue or gel that just keeps your eyebrows in place. Is it gonna let them move around? There's nothing worse than getting your eyebrows looking really, really nice. And you've got all the hairs where you want them. And then, within like a few minutes, they've all just dropped back down. <laughs> okay, so final two products. So the first one is a highlighter, which might be a bit boring to some people because honestly, no one's really bothered about highlighter, but I love highlighter. And this one is a really, really affordable one that I absolutely love. And I've been using it to death. It's in my everyday like makeup rotation at the minute. And that is the Essence The Highlighter. And I have mine in the shade Mesmerizing. I think this is the lightest shade they have. I've been using this so much that like, I'm wearing away the highlighter bit in the middle, if that makes sense. Like the writing, the embossed writing. I love this highlighter. It just looks so nice and it really blends in to the skin. It doesn't just like sit on top. Um, I do buff it in a little bit. Uh, just because that's what I that's how I apply my highlighter nowadays. But I just love how it looks. It just blends in with everything, it doesn't just look like a strip. Like I really, really do love it. And I've been really loving using it lately. And it is my current favourite highlighter. It's the one that I reach for when I open my jaw. It's always this one. Okay, so then this last product is an eyeshadow product for me. I don't use it for anything else. And that is the Made by Mitchell Liquid Blush in the shade Drip Drip. The glittery silver one. I believe they have this now in gold too, which I really do want to try. I love this. I love it because it just adds, you can, you can do either or. You can have it built up really thick and look really dramatic on your eyes or you can blend it out like not take too much of the glitter on your eye and it just adds this like subtle something something you know I really 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 like it to just elevate my looks I love this and it's gonna last me forever because I use so little of it but when this runs out if it ever runs out I will 100% be repurchasing a new one because it is just amazing. I absolutely love it. So those are all of my current favorite makeup products. There wasn't loads because like I said, I didn't want to just pick stuff for the sake of it. But yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want to see more videos like this, please consider subscribing because... I'm really trying to hit 700 subscribers before my birthday. And if you did enjoy this video, please leave a like because it really, really does help me out. Leave a comment of a... I don't know. What should we comment today? Comment a smiley face emoji. Oh no, comment the star eyes emoji. Yeah, we'll do that one. Comment the star eyes emoji if you watched until the end. And yeah, that's everything I have for you guys today. I really hope you enjoyed and I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.